want to do. You say you're pretty fast, don't you? Look around. We don't have time to go slow. Back some bad memories, but where's everybody else? Uh, finally, you guys are okay. Where are the others? I don't know. I thought they were with you. No, Red, we can't leave them, not after everything. But we can't. Okay, all right. I got one last location I can check, all right? Mm -hmm. This plane already fueled up. Yeah. You ready to go? Yeah, all right. Now, we cannot sacrifice everyone else, okay? All right, so be ready when I get back. Nick, that's what they call you now. We must go. Wait, wait, you are Isabella Keys. I've heard rumors about no, you. No, you don't understand. What is it you have to tell me? No more hints, just out with it. Your government built a lab near my village. All to make fatter cattle for your fat country to eat. And with the lab came soldiers from the US Army. They did what young men do. They spread their seed. And then, when Dr. Barnaby discovered the bees, well, the zombies came. And your government killed most of the survivors, so no one will tell the truth. Carlito thought it would be fitting that he should send the children back to the country which helped create them. Little time bombs like your friend Diego. But he did not want to create something unstoppable. So he made one of the orphans immune. Oh my god, Nick. This is you, Nick. You are the little life capsule Carlito planted. Me? You're what we've been waiting for. You can be cured. Dr. Mallon wants the cure, and she will do anything to get it. She's looking for you now. We must go. Well, I know it doesn't look like much, but... We must take our chances now. Nick! Annie! Come on out here! Okay, that's right. We need to get everyone. Nick, please! for red. You sure gave up on your family fast. Come on, Nick. I told you, I'm a realist. I'm tired of living like a pariah. And when I saw that flyer, I realized that was the closest to $5 million that I ever was going to get. So guess what? I got your friends. You are my $5 million. So let's make an exchange. I'm going to kill you with my bare fucking hands, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I like this.
you okay? Yeah, yeah, go find a way to get out of here. Come on. Go! You're coming with me. One of the family, huh? No. Family of one, Nick. Just like you. No. Nothing like me. Time for me to get the prize, Nick. You're not gonna win. Always leave that eye on my girl. Who else? Uh, you oh. Everybody gets shit. I wanted it to be my time. But you're right about one thing. What? 
It is your time. Nick! Annie, are you okay? Yeah. That's Hemlock's voice. Negative, sir. We have him cornered. Uh, requesting additional time to mop things up. Very well. I'll grant another day. Malin will be happy to have more time. Our work here is not yet complete regardless. Mine isn't either. my mind when you ran away. Shit, that's real cute, ain't it? Ooh, I love a happy ending. Dad, I'm, I'm sorry. I just, I saw what it was doing you, the pressure to, to keep me unregistered and to find Zombrex all the time. It, it wrecks people, that drug. I didn't want to burden you anymore. You've never been a burden to me, honey. It's not your fault what happened to me. I'm the one who's the burden. I'm, I'm not proud of what I've done. I've been looking for you for so long. You're the man Gary works for. I'm not letting Annie go with some thug. I don't give a shit if she is your daughter. She's not your property. I've been looking for my daughter for two years. And now there's a zombie outbreak like the one that killed her mother. You don't know what that's like. Who the hell is this? Nick Ramos. Who are you? Chuck Green. Okay, it's okay. Dad, I mean, how, did, how did you find me? I found Gary. He overheard where you were going. I wanted to kill him for letting you go. I never seen the fat bastard so happy. It's been a long time, Chuck Green. Isabella Keys. What the hell are you doing here? Your face. Dr. Malin was always envious of me. At least I can still walk. It is imperative that we get this man to a safe place immediately. What, that little pipsqueak? <laughs> You're kidding me, right? He contains within him, within his body, the cure, the antidote to the parasite. Come, we must get to this plane. We don't have much time. Let's do this. Stay. What? No, we figured that we'll round up anybody who's still alive and we'll truck them out of here. We'll, we'll find a way. I can't leave you guys. You're the important one, Nick. <sighs> Don't ever forget you got a family right here. Okay? All right. Come on. Get out of here. Get out of here. Damn, man. We're finally getting out of here. Sir, General Hemlock, sir. 
Time to get cold feet, buddy. Hemlock's doing something here in town, collecting something. What the hell's that guy looking for? The substance the King Zombies give off will be very powerful if collected or synthesized. We must go. But we can't just let him do it. We're so close to a cure, a cure to your own disease. Don't you want that? But don't you get it? It might not even matter if we have a cure if he has something like that. Whatever it is, it's starting now. Annie's right. Cure won't mean a thing if we don't stop this. Nick, please! Dad, what are you doing? Katie, I used to be the guy who solved problems, not caused them. We are gonna get that son of a bitch. Uh, Nick! Dad, give me that! Come on, I will get up on the crane. I'll tell you where he's going. Not quite sure what my daughter sees in you. You want to impress me? Here's your chance. Shit! 